something like this is something that I, my camera should have been doing. Oh, there's four of them now. <laughs> oh, the other one's a butcher bird. Yeah. The one, the one on the railing. That, that kills other birds. Oh, really? Yeah. It's a butcher bird. It catches mice and things. They hang them up in trees. Yeah. That's why they call them a butcher bird. Oh, that's the one there that's actually get rid of those. It's gone now. You know the one that's getting rid of other birds' eggs? Yeah, ah, no, that's creepy. Ah. Mm. Let me try to have a look on the... My phone's only got one bars left. Oh, I'm going to get the other camera. Oh, the wind! No. It must be full. Ah, uh, you probably run out of here too quick. You scared them. Oh, that could be it. I was singing loudly. <laughs> That's how you call them. So how often do they come here, do you think? Oh, really? So what is the best time for these birds to come around? This kind of time, early morning? Yeah. Maybe they'll come back. Yeah. You know, that's uh, very sad whenever we traveled in um, the Outback way. It's, you, you don't even see any birds flying anywhere. And it got me wondering what on earth happened with the birds. You don't hear anything. And that surprises me seeing something, some nice colorful birds right here. Yeah. <laughs> I hope I don't. Uh, oh, I'm not on it now. No. <laughs> no, you're not. Hang on, I'm going to find it. Okay. Do that, because I got it on Zoom to the birds. Oh. Hold on. Okay, try again. Lower, lower. <laughs> oh, oh, my, oh, my God. How did you do that? Can you do that again? Can you do that again? What the? Oh, now I got it. That's your thumb. How did I? <laughs> Hang on. All right. Let me just see. <laughs> That's not easy at all. <laughs> All right, so we're just going to wait for the birds. Perhaps they'll come back. If you see, they're actually wild lorikeets. 
Am I right? Yeah. I thought it's is lorikeets uh, related to parrots? They are a parrot. It is a parrot. It is a parrot. Oh. Yeah, a parrot. All right. Well, those tiny birds that you have in the cage, they looks like parrots too, aren't they? Yeah, no, they're, they're parrots down there. Yeah, this one there. Yeah, they're little, little parrots, like something else. They're fishes. Oh, you, you know, I was so amazed when I went there one day videoing them and I just zoomed in so closely into the square hole. And the things that they do, if you, if you capture something, you, you'll be surprised. Yeah, well, I've got a camera I can watch on TV. Yeah? Oh, have you? Yeah, there's a camera hanging. I don't know whether it's oh, still... Oh, right, really? So whether it's still working or not, I don't know. Yeah. It was cutting out. But I, I can turn the TV on and I can... Because I, I was trying to work out what birds were with what birds. Yeah. And the speech is in the Yeah. I'm just going to zoom in. So you actually got that in your room then, that camera down there? Yeah, that's what this guy is playing All right. The weather is still works, I don't know. I haven't tried it on TV for ages. Yeah. So I can sit, I, so before I used to sit inside and I could watch what's happening in the bird aviary. Yeah. On boring days. That's amazing to see all this. Look at that, especially that blue one, that type of color. What's that? Teal? Teal blue? Oh, I don't know. There was mice getting in there and I uh, reckon all the nests. Yeah. Because all the bunnies and nest and all the pigeons and nest. And the mice were getting in all their nest boxes. It's mm. like a poison. It was like a plague of mice. Oh, really? Yeah. Every time I went down there, there was a new nest with babies in it. Oh, yeah. I have seen they, this back in... Because they had plagues out, out west. Yeah. And, like, and uh, everywhere in there. All right. I um, nearly killed them all. There's like one or two left. I only put more poison down the S for that. Yeah. How many birds do you have in there? I was about 40 or 50. Three different species? Two. Two? It's only the budgies and the finches. Yeah. Oh, look at those two lovers right there. Right at the frontier. Yeah, yeah. That's the one that I had on the video. And look, that's amazing. They must be yeah, a couple. They're really, they're really <laughs> passionate with each other. Yeah, because that's what yeah. I have on the video. Like I had over eight minutes of it. Yeah, the male chats up the chick and then another, I see another male will probably come along. Mm. And go, hey, I want her. <laughs> yeah, it was such a funny moment when I captured these two, uh, not this one, the other couple. And then, you know, I thought it were like the other one was flying around with the other birds and the next thing the other one turned around, got closer and the other one just opened the wings more like, yeah. get out of my way. Yeah, <laughs> yeah they argue with each other, you hear them squawking. <laughs> they, have, they have their own little chatter with each other. Yeah. Uh, it's such a nice color. Oh, well, there is my bird that I have been looking for every time we are on the road with my my previous. <laughs> I call it previous now. Yeah. And then we, there's one wild bird that we let go that was a baby. We yeah. already found near her work and brought here. We had it, it, it lived in the bedroom oh. for a month or more. Yeah. So now, what did you actually see those other birds? You had rice? Oh, they, they. Any of them, scratch. Yeah. Vegetables, bread. So the wild parrots earlier, yeah, they, they this the is what they had. The wild. Bread and rice. Oh, yeah. Put honey on it. Yeah. So you look at that where they actually are. Um, they come here every day apparently for over five years. So how many years do birds like this really live? Yeah? Ha what? Yeah. We're talking about our years, not animal yeah. years. Yeah. They live longer than us. Oh, That's rubbish. Right. Yeah. 100 years. Come on. Yeah. No, they live over Tiny creature like, oh, look at this other one right there. He's yeah, in she, his. He's sitting on eggs. Oh, is that why they've been going in that nesting? But 
think I eat heat laying eggs, and, but none of them are hatching. Yeah? So I think about two females in the wild. So what birds is this one then? Canary. Canary? Yeah, both they, both they of these color? I wonder why, maybe something to do with what they are eating? No. Do you think? No. That's otherwise there's three females and you need a male mm. to fertilize the eggs. But I think he's a male. Otherwise, I'll get another male anyway, I think you put in there, I don't know. Mm. But those two are all, the other one with the same color are always together, I notice. The whole three of them, they all sit in there, sit on the eggs. Oh, really? Because I've never had canaries before, so this is the first time I've tried to breed them. Yeah. But normally they sing, yeah, they get around a good whistle. So do you know how to tell the difference between the male and female? Uh, the male will sing. Huh? The male will sing a song, and the females don't. <laughs> the male will sing a song, and the female don't. <laughs> This is how you tell what the difference between canary male or female. I think uh, Steve is joking. Seriously. They whistle, they got a whistle thing. Oh, really? Is that what the the well, research say? Yeah, no, I've heard it before. They go for it. They, they whistle out of tune. Mm. You see the difference? This yellow one is slimmer compared to the other two that seems to be like as if they have boobs. Yeah, or, <laughs> or otherwise fat asses. <laughs> Give it a shake. Or otherwise, otherwise the breeding, breeding time is supposed to be winter, I think. All right. But they've been laying eggs all through summer. Yeah. I look forward to have these other birds coming back. Oh, they might come back later. Maybe I'll just leave it on and enjoy my coffee for now. Someone did come and join us, uh, join my live. Now they left. Now I'm just gonna eat my mango. We're going to wait and see if the birds is coming back. Yeah, I had that last time. <laughs> there goes one. <laughs> that is the Australian magpie. <laughs> I had him last time when I was alive. <laughs> I'm just going to eat my mango. Have you ever tried collecting any photos from these birds and then sell it online? No. Nah. Oh, I've got heaps of photos. Yeah. There is a lot of um, apps where you can actually sell photos. But then to sell them, you gotta make sure you don't use any watermarks. 